and they have a cat on there the clouty cat which is kind of cute too I've kind of seen that they have 7,769 followers as of right now with a coin value of 5,067 and some pennies so it's they're awesome and and of, of course you told me before Brian that you guys were on Twitter as well you had a big following there and I know that you had that on your profile a little while back where you said how many you had there and all that I mean it's a it's an accomplishment to have lots of followers because that's what everybody wants right but lots of times people don't want them for that right reason so let's get into you know a little bit of your background so tell us tell uh tell the bitcloud listeners here what this you know what's your background how did you get into social media right how how and how did you get to here yeah so, so we had a background in in compute computer uh we ran forums message boards for about 15 years uh going back to like the early 2000s uh and, and then when all the political stuff happened in the us uh we mm. kind of jumped on twitter and okay. in 2016 about 2017 late 2016 and we grew our accounts within a matter of like I'd say a year and a half to over a million followers combined. Um, we ended it with about 1.6 million followers, but uh, we did it by just just engaging with people and and figuring out what people wanted and and kind of giving them information that they wanted and at, in a fast in a fast matter yeah. manner. And uh, and we also replied to the president Donald Trump at the time, and we kind of reverse engineered Twitter's algorithms so that we would have we didn't break any of the rules but but we we figured out like what got you high up when you replied to a person and we kept doing it and we ended up basically whenever we wanted to we could get between one and five in the top comments under the president and uh we got we started getting noticed and that got us more followers and we would get interviews by the media and, and all that so our account would just keep growing and growing and growing and we got so good at it that twitter actually thought that we were buying our engagement and buying accounts and in may of 2019 they banned both of our accounts and put out a statement to the press that said we were buying our engagement and our accounts which were was totally untrue and we're actually We've been in discussions with our through our attorney with their attorneys over the last two years and something big is going to happen in the next i think few weeks uh i don't want to say anything i'm not exactly sure what but basically twitter is going to have to go back on some of what they said mm. whether we get our accounts back or not i don't really care too much uh but uh at least they'll make it right with the press and and our names will be kind of cleared from the manipulators that they yeah. kind of portrayed us as yeah that's that that's quite the story I mean uh 